It was 1-2-3 for the boys from Thorny Lee. I'm Stephen Hanjack for Mass Golf and here at Weston Golf Club. It was all Thorny Lee at the top of the leaderboard and Matt Parziali has won his third Massachusetts Mid Amateur Championship. Yeah, uh, I mean, I was fortunate enough to win two before, but uh, those are in the past, so it's always always good to win. Um, I'm happy with the way I played. Like I said yesterday, I haven't been playing much, so to put two rounds here like this, um, a few more mistakes today, but a lot, uh, some more birdies and more chances, so um, I'm very happy with the, the game I had the last two days. I was very disappointed with the three putt I had on nine. Actually hit a good first putt, just went a little further by, and then the second putt, I just misread it, so I wasn't too, but the, the three putt on 10 was, 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 wasn't good. Uh, it was a poor second putt, so um, I just need to get myself going. And then Ryan made a great putt on for birdie on 12. And then to respond with that six, seven footer I had for par, um, that was probably the key putt I had today. Like I said yesterday, the, the par putt I had on three. I drove it very well the last two days, and to hit it out there far, um, you have a shorter clubs in. So um, that definitely helps. Um, doesn't mean you're gonna win because you hit it far, but I was able to hit it far and hit it in the fairway, which, which was which was nice, and um, I got some good numbers, especially on the stretch where I was able to hit one close on uh, on 15 there, so um, to get some birdies um, after in in uh, capitalizing on those long drives. I wouldn't say it could have been a better start for, for a three-week stretch, um, so I'm happy with uh, the result, um, but still a lot of work to do to be ready for, for the next two weeks, so I'm looking forward to, to putting the work in and uh, getting ready for those, but uh, yeah, it's definitely, uh, definitely a good start for, for this next uh, upcoming stretch. Siobhan Baumet got hot with the putter and had three late birdies to finish as runner-up, which is the highest finish he's had in a mass golf event. Yeah, no, I played really good today. Um, I really had one bad swing on the ninth hole, my tee shot went to the hazard left and they doubled there. But other than that, I played really, really solid golf. Um, and on back nine, my putter got hot, so it was nice. Yeah, I think, you know, the speed of the greens from yesterday to today, today was a little bit faster, it dried out a little bit. But, you know, I, I putt fast greens well, because um, I'm a die putter. I think for me, the big putt was on the uh, 13th hole, uh, putting it from the fringe up the hill. That was a big momentum keeper for me. Um, but yeah, I got the speeds well. You know, you have to putt well to win, right? So I got the speeds down pretty good. Got really lucky there. I hit a terrible drive right, and I was hoping it would go further right because it actually opens up. But I had a, a shot where I could draw it around. I actually pulled it. I didn't want to tell anyone. It actually went through the tree. It didn't go over it. It actually went through the tree, and I got really lucky. I mean, you need some breaks to finish well, and I got one break there, so it was nice to see that. Rounding out the top five was Ryan Riley, 10-time champion of this event, Frank Vanna Jr., and Kyle Tibbetts. Thank you again to Weston Golf Club for playing host, and we will see you next year at Marlboro Country Club.